What's up, everybody? Fravis here with another episode of Magic Tools Origins, and we are going to play today. What do you want? What do you want to play? What do you want to play? Bagger? That's my favorite deck. No, let's not do Bagger. Let's do. Let's 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 continue with what happened last week. Oh, wait, 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 wait. No, of course we can't do that because I've been actually getting this uh, this issue. joining oh my god it actually worked oh my what, what am i even playing oh shit i don't even know what i'm playing what am i what am i even playing oh my god uh okay well it's a surprise i mean i guess you already know because i'm gonna play three three of these <laughs> i have no idea what i'm playing guys uh cats ate my face great great name super dupers <clears throat> this is oh this is uh this is my Boros. Uh, I tried to make a double striking deck. This is not good. <laughs> so uh, let's let. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! This is like the exact same. This is the exact same hand as before, but strictly worse. Why? Why do I even? Oh god! This is awful. <laughs> this is awful. What? What have I done? What? This is awful. What a terrible hand. I have no plays. I have nothing to do. I have nothing to do. This is like. Oh my god. All right, I got something to do now. I got something to do. Uh, I guess um, what what is this? Eroa's champion, double strike. This is a flat double striker. Uh, that has uh, first strike. No, it has vigilance. Okay, so we're good. Oh wow, how embarrassing. Um, I'm gonna hold off on that and just drop. He's not showing green, so I shouldn't be worried about land destruction, but. Regardless, we're going to be putting that guy down and we're going to be passing turn because we have no plays left because we are tapped out because we played a 2-2 double striker for three, which is how many lands we have. And I wish I can show you how cute my cat is snapping right now. So we are up against, I have no idea. Uh, so far, it looks like Orzov Renown, but Black doesn't have any Renown. Does it? Does it have any Renown? I don't think Black has Renown, so I don't know what, what we're up against. I really don't know. Um, Nimbus Wings to get that Renown trigger. Good job. You did it. Uh, Kithian's Irregulars is probably my drop here. Um, because it's not like I'm going to swing in. Or do I just not? Do I could just... You know what I could do, actually? Fuck that. I'll Celestial Flare. I don't want that 4-5 hitting me anymore. Um... Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh my. On the other hand, I could hit him for six. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Enchanting. How enchanting? Uh, this is actually plus two, so I don't mind if I do. I will do exactly that. Uh, normally, I don't like doing this, but since I have double strike, I'm gonna. I'm gonna. And that's eight damage right there, which is a lot. Um, I, I've never actually played this deck against a human opponent. I don't know if it's any good. It is centered around uh, Boros Double Strike. I'm trying to get my Double Strikers in there and do as much damage with them as possible, but it's sort of it sort of just grabs auras and taps and does other janky stuff because there, honestly, there's not a lot of Double Strike in there. And I almost want to put green in here to like give things trample, but if I put green in, then I'm gonna to have to put red in. I mean, I already have the red in, but <laughs> it's it's a weird deck. I I tried to make a double strike thing. Uh, I was working on it for a while, but I don't feel like it's really working out. And uh, I don't think I'm gonna do anything about it actually. <laughs> I don't give a shit about. Ooh, I don't give a shit about that. It doesn't fly. It does not fly. I will save my Celestial Flare. That's what I'm going to do. 4-5 Double Strike. Obviously gotta tap his Flyer. Which is fine by me. Hit him for another 8. That's a lot of damage, bro. And leave my Celestial Flare open. Yopin! Let's see, what's he gonna pop here? He's gonna get rid of his... 4-3 on the ground. 
Divine favor. Oh, well now it doesn't. Now he's going to get rid of his 4-5. Which is fine by me, actually. Oh, very fine by me. <clears throat> oh, it's 5-6. Excuse me. He's gonna, I, I think he swings all in here, right? I think so. There's no need to hold back with either of them. The one that flies and can block has vigilance, so he might as well swing. And the one that can't block doesn't... He can't block. So who gives a shit? You, sir, get to sacrifice a creature. How lucky you are. Uh, go right ahead. Wow, that was a quick decision. Uh, okay. Fine. Uh, that's not a problem. That's not a problem. Well, is it a... <sighs> oh, that's not good. Well, alright, so that's the end of my guy. Um... Eight, nine, ten. That's not enough. Not enough. Not enough. I have to swing in. Have to swing in. No choice. Because he's going to lock my guy down next turn. No matter what. Uh, yeah, might as well go ahead. Um. Hmm. Hmm, 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 hmm. Five. All right, so he's got four that's coming in for the suppression bonds. So how many lands does he have open? He's got like one or two, two lands open if he if he if he's got nothing else. So can he lock this down for two? I don't think so. I don't think so. I'm thinking about it. I think this is okay. Twin bolt won't do shit right now. I think I'm okay. I don't think he can get lethal he can he can't all right so i'm thinking he can suppression bond my 4-3 blocker and with the two power he has to deal an additional uh, th uh two damage to me which i don't think he has he can do one extra damage if he has an aura but i don't think he can do another damage and you know what he didn't suppression bond the right guy anyway so it doesn't even matter uh so he has to uh, well, first he hopes that I don't get a land. That's that's number one. Because if I get a land next turn, uh, this guy's coming in unblockably. Hold up, hold up. Oh, God damn it! Game, game. Uh, it costs four. Yeah. All right. So I'm not actually gonna block this. <clears throat> he needs another blocker. Oh no! Right, right, right. He has. Lifelink, I forgot about that. Forgot about that silly Billy Lifelink. Huh. Tap target creature. Tap target creature. I'm thinking, guys. I'm thinking. Okay. This is what we're doing. We're popping this. We're swinging in. We're going to do four damage to his shitter. At the beginning of his turn, I'm tapping his 5-6. So he doesn't gain that uh, gain that life. I am pretty sad about losing out on the... Uh, on the hoodies. On the uh, twin bolt. Sorry, I'm not, I'm not talking very much right now. I'm thinking real hardcore right now. I'm, I'm, I don't want to fuck this up. I'm pretty close. Nope. We're doing this. He knows that's coming. That is not a surprise. <clears throat> it shouldn't be a surprise. What are his plays? He's a good player. He knows how to play it. He's doing it real well. Uh, yeah, that could do it. Depending what I get. It depends what I get. I don't know. I just don't know. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide it. Come on, come on, come on, baby. I love it. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Oh, uh, that's that's good. That's very good. That's exactly what I would have liked to see. And now that's unblockable, and now he's dead. All right. Excellent. Yep, he's gone. I figured. 
Whew. Close game. I was live to one of those for like two turns, so only a matter of time. And I mean, I, I was I was drawing quite a bit of things. I don't remember exactly what's in this deck because honestly, I built it a long time ago. Uh, played it against. Um, played it against. Let, let's stick with it. Let's stick with it. I chose it. We'll do it. Double trouble. Um, I played it against AI for a little bit. Determined it wasn't as good as it could be, and. I sort of just backburnered it and then went on to like other things like um, land destruction and uh, enchantments and 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 you know even back to Thopters because you know I just fucking love Thopters and uh, I never touch it again so I, I really don't remember what's in this deck it's sort of a, a surprise to me I mean I, I guess at the end of the video I'll, I'll go through it with you guys because I know some of you really like to see that um, this is a weird one I will keep it it's not not the best I'm I'm a little aggressive. I don't mind that. I'm actually I'm incredibly aggressive. If I get another white, I'm stupidly aggressive. I don't even know how many lands I'm running. 24? I hope 24. Fuck me, I don't know. I'm sorry about that bell ringing. That's my cat scratching his adorable little nuzzly, nuzzly face. He's giving me this look like he's the biggest baddest bitch in the world, which is just fucking hilarious. Um I will probably just tighten strength right here so I can scry. I mean, I don't really give a shit, honestly. Uh, okay, I'll take it. I will take it. Then I'll, then I'll have three. That's fine. I, I know I could do it on my attack step, but he only has one mana, and I don't think there's anything other than, what, a fucking fog? Does he want to fog four damage off? Like, I'd fucking laugh at him if he did that, honestly, but whatever. So I did it first main. Could have done it. Attack step, but I'm not, I'm, I, really, I really don't give a shit. I wanted that scry. That's, that's the big thing. Needed to have that scry happen. What? Uh, plus three. Yeah, that's fine. Needed to have it happen. He cannot block. I will justify not playing Knight of the White Orchid. No, that's not, that's not happening. Never mind. I'm completely a liar right now. He can't block that. It has menace. Yeah, Knight of the White Orchid is definitely coming down. He's not going to ramp me. I hate when he doesn't ramp me. And I hate I hate it because like I feel like it's a missed opportunity. Like I didn't play that card to its potential. And it really pisses me off. That's why I really want I hate that card, but it's a 2-2 two -two first strike, you know? And and another thing I hate it, it's fucking too white. Oh, too white. Like everything here is too white. That's that's not aggro, man. That's oh, I don't know, man. Uh how do I feel about it? I'm not sure. Kotha Fed's gone. He knows he's up against some seriousness. Um, I could Twin Bolt that O2, which would be a waste, so I'm not going to do that. The O2 is probably gone now. I think he's going to throw it out, unless he's got tricks for me later. If he doesn't block here, then... Oh, Alright, he, he, he might have tricks for me. Interesting. I wonder why he didn't block that. Uh, he might have some shit in his hand. Uh, which actually... Oh, no, he didn't. That's why he left. Okay, uh, I was thinking like a, uh, a language or something, but even if he had a language, he would still block. Like I don't know why. I'm not. I'm not sure what he would have. That that's a sad play. That's very sad to see. Uh, never really want to see Anissa come down so quickly. And is this it? Is this done? Let's see. Let's see how we let. Uh, okay, so he can block. At most, two damage. So four is getting through. I can make it up to six damage getting through. Or I can pop one of his creatures. And get in for six anyway. Nah, this is... No. No point in spending any cards right now. Just swing in. If he wants to trade some, he can trade some. I'm, I'll find that very acceptable. Fine. That's fine. How many lands do you have? Three, four? So he can't, uh... I don't think he can do shit, honestly. So I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna pop that Nissa. I'd... What, what's the Nissa gonna do, right? Like, who gives a shit? I'm gonna pop whoever he doesn't sacrifice. And I guess I'll, I'll get rid of uh, the first striker. I don't need to pop the Nissa. He still can't stop this. Oh, fine. I'll just 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 because I can, I will. <laughs> There's really no reason for it. Then we'll have a perfect game. I evened him down to zero while he 
well, I took zero damage, so fucking <laughs> perfect. Perfect. Finish him. Fravos wins. Excellent. Well done. Textbook game. I can't believe how fucking uh, quickly I'm getting through these. I'm just ripping through these guys. Holy crap. Are you guys waiting for Zendikar? I sure am. You see that uh, thing on Facebook that uh, Stainless released? They're like, Oh, sorry, we're really dedicated to perfection. That's why we can't uh, That's why we can't release Zendikar in the state that it's in. And it's like, yeah, we, we knew. Stainless, we knew. We know. We, we know you can't finish a game on time. We know you can't. You can't get things working. It's 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 par for the course, you guys. You, you can spin it in a way that says, oh, you know, you're quality protecting, you know. And that's bullshit. You guys just, you suck at making games. All right, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like, I am I appreciate the game. I really like it. I honestly do. I But I like it because it's Magic the Gathering, not because you made it. You know, it, it's... I feel like Stainless really dropped quite a ball here. I mean, but honestly, they, they they've done this every year. The, every fucking year, man. This is just what they do. It's the game has literally been getting worse every iteration that they that they release. I mean, hopefully, I'm still hopeful. Don't get me wrong. I'm still gonna play it. I still like it. I love this game. I really, really do. So I'm not gonna like bail on him, and I'll still support him with my money. I I will if I, if you want me to vote with my wallet. You know, just because I'm disappointed doesn't mean I'm not gonna be you know a consumer, and I will be a consumer. Um, but it also means that I'm that I'm gonna express my dissatisfaction with your with the way you're running things. You know, that's just now you, you're running like like stainless is watching my videos. <laughs> yeah, yeah, right. <clears throat> anyway, I'm uh, kind of excited to be releasing a video now. I mean, I'm actually really sad. A lot of people have not been releasing videos. Isn't it crazy? I mean, Headcase hardly releases anything. He's he's down to like once every other week or so, maybe every three weeks. Technovolver, he just finished the single player campaign and he hasn't released a single video in, oh my god, I don't know, a month? Uh, fucking Mobius Chicken Strips did a game with uh, Hakim, uh, uh, Hakim, I guess he, he got really demotivated, de um, demotivated or, or something because people downvoted it or, or just didn't like him very much and just shit on his parade. I mean, the other option here was Kithian, but I kind of want to, uh, he's gone. He's. I'm not actually playing Red Deck Wins, man. You don't have to, I mean, I think he felt like he knows what I'm playing. Uh, he doesn't know what I'm playing. I'm not playing the Red Deck Wins, dude. It's just because I'm running this card. Uh, I feel like I scared him off. Anyway, um, yeah, so Mobius Chicken Strips, he fucking bailed. He hasn't released a video in a hell of a long time. Uh, I assume he just can't handle, you know, the criticisms that people have with his, uh, with his, let, let, let's call it an attitude. Do I want to drop Kithian now? What is he playing? Green, black. I don't want to drop Kithian right now. No, I, I don't feel comfortable doing that. I'll, I'll leave the twin bolt open. I, Kithian's kind of a serious deal, and I don't want to just throw him into a, throw him into a, like a, a simple black removal spell or something. Doesn't feel right. <clears throat> Um, yeah, so Mobius fucking jumped ship, and now even fucking Hakim is like, nah, fuck this, I'm, I'm, I can't, I can't get, get the game to run on Xbox, and now, uh, I'm just gonna wait for Zendikar, and until then I'm gonna be playing other games, and that's what they said, and then they're fucking gone, so they're, nobody's, like, releasing games. The only people who are releasing, fucking Force, every Friday, so once a week, and Legend VD, who doesn't do it every week, he does it, like, every other week or so. Uh, rarely. Rarely are people dropping fucking things right now, and... <sighs> I don't know how to feel about that. I mean, not particularly bad, just... I don't know. I don't know. Let's see. What um, I, what I want to do is Nimbus Wings my Double Striker. And then get in for, what, uh, 6, 7, 8? But... Um, I want to take care of that 1-1 one, one now. So what I could do instead is Twin Bolt and then drop Kithian. And then give Kithian Nimbus Wings if I have to get him. You know what? No, that's that's actually what I'm going to do. Th this way I have a little better tempo. I'll just drop him now. He's already tapped out. It makes no difference. 
and now, um, I mean, I won't swing in for as much damage right now, but Kithian will be able to flip next turn, and I'll have his Indestructible online. Uh, so depending on what he plays, I'll either keep Kithian's Indestructible online, or I'll drop a Nimbus Wings. And I am not uh, opposed to dropping a Nimbus Wings on Kithian, by the way. I will do that if I have to. Uh, no plays is very concerning to me. Looks like Kithian is flipping. Nope, here we go. Fog. Okay. But he still attacked, right? Uh, if he attacks this combat, then flip him. Yep, and that's exactly what happened. So even with that fog, I'm still getting a Kithian in play. Uh, a Planeswalker in play. So uh, that didn't stop shit. This guy's coming down. And I guess I'll... What do I want to do? Until next turn, target creature gets indestructible. Do I want to do that? Yeah, I guess. Um, let's give it to... Who's better? The double striker, because I can hit him with a Nimbus Wings and then really fuck up his day. And I'll even put down the Sky Hunter too, because fuck the world. So. Actually, you know what? I am... I am uh, a language could happen, but I think this guy's playing elves. So it's unlikely that he's going to even run ang Languish in this. Yeah, he is he is playing else, so he does not play uh, Languish in this deck because that uh, that doesn't really mesh very well with me <laughs> with, with elves. This just in, um, and now I'm coming in completely unblockable. Wow, this deck is doing a lot better than I remember it supposing to do, which is just fucking crazy. Uh, he can't block any of this. This is all coming straight to his nugget, and this is I think game. Wow. Well, that was easy. <laughs> I think I'll just record another one right now. Oh, wait, what time is it? Uh, so, and uh, by the way, guys, speaking of uh, people who aren't recording, like, uh, uh, your old buddy Fravis is, uh, is in that pack, too. Not necessarily uh, because I'm sick of the game or anything, just because I have a, a very tiny apartment and about 10 million people living in it. My uh, brother-in-law just moved in with his girlfriend, so now there's four people living in a three- or two-bedroom apartment. So it's, uh... It's kind of tough to find time to hang out in the living room and record a game, and uh, I really, really, really feel bad about that, and it does actually bother me uh, quite seriously, honestly. I said I would go through this uh, this deck with you guys, so let's just take a look and see what I decided to put in here. Obviously, Kithian, uh, three copies of the Glory Chaser, super nice card. Not sure about this guy. This is, this is kind of weird. Um, I mean, it does mesh with Double Strike, I guess. It, it's pretty good. That would be an extra six damage if I can get it in at the last second. Definitely don't like Knight of the White Orchid. Not sure why I'm running him. I'm probably going to cut this guy. Uh, this probably for the double strike, it kind of meshes. I don't know about him either. Are these two guys just fillers? Like, I'm not sure about that. Uh, this stops blockers, which helps double strikes get in their face. This helps your double strikes get in their face. Celestial Flare helps double strikes get in people's face. It's a nice little bit of removal. Not the best removal, uh, but I think I need more removal in this. So, uh, for two drop, I mean, I got a lot of white. This is very white heavy. So, I'm, I'm like, as I'm going through this, I'm seeing a, uh, some problems here. Uh, maybe we can fix it as, as we play this throughout the week. Uh, Skyhunter Skirmisher, obviously, is a double striker. Chandra is just damage to the face, which is really kind of what, you know, double strike is anyway. Uh, obviously, this person double strikes. Obviously, this guy taps creatures to get the double strikes in. I have no idea why fucking Hixus is in here. This is weird. He's a 4-4 four, four for 5 with Flash, so he sort of has haste, kind of. Do I use him for the removal? I mean, here's my removal. I don't like some of this, you guys. Uh, for for instance, the, the, the cards I want to fix... By the way, uh, <laughs> what the fuck is this? I have... Why do I have an even split? This is all... F all right, I, I gotta... I, I gotta fix some of this, you guys. This is... And... All right, I can see why I'm running this, I, and I want a few of these, actually. Uh, just dump another red, I guess. No, you don't want to dump that many. Wait, do I need red, really? I don't have that much red. No, I'm going to dump a red. This is a weird deck, you guys. I don't know if you should play it. Now that I'm thinking about it, I, now that I'm thinking about it, I, I do want just two Rogue's Passage. Uh, Hicks, this has got to get out of here. This is fucking white weird. I don't know why he's here. Uh, Celestial Flare is weird. I'm not sure why. I don't know why this guy's in here. What, what, what was I thinking? Honestly, this is some wonky-tonky 
dinky donkey shit right here, man. <laughs> I want creatures that support double strike. I want my double strike things to get in here. Does this support double strike? Kind of? I don't like running one drops. Ugh. I don't like any of this shit. Until end of turn, otherwise he's just a 2-2. Two -two. This guy is first strike at least. Oh man, you guys. <laughs> how, do, how do I fix this? How do you think, how would you, if you guys have any suggestions, please hit me up, seriously, I'm, I'm, I don't know what to do with this. This is weird, and I don't have the brain power at, at the current moment in my life. I mean, this is removal, why aren't I running Perilous Mirror? Whatever. Alright, uh, I love you guys, I will see you next time with, uh, hopefully a better deck. Uh, see you guys next time, obviously. I will quit without saving, I'll, I'll just fix all this later. <laughs> What am I doing? All right, so this is probably... All right, all right, all right, all right. Before I go, yeah, this is the deck I'm going to be using uh, throughout the week. I'm going to try to get as many uh, episodes as in as possible. I expect uh, at least one more, I hope. Um, I, I will try to get in as, as much as, as I can. Uh, I have several drafts. I, I am doing a lot of Battle for Zendikar drafts at my uh, local game store, and I would suggest that you guys do it too because it's actually quite fun even though... Uh, the individual cards of the set might not uh, be super bomby, but still, it's a great set. I, I really love it. <sighs> you know what? I'll see you guys next time. Love you, homies.